Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So I'm waiting on them to call me for my dermatology appointment because your girl's skin is just, I feel like I'm a teenager all over again and this is not okay. Uh, I waited like six months for it to clear up because I did like change from like North Carolina to Kansas, but uh, yeah, it really did not help. So now we gotta take, you know, take it serious. Um, So I'm waiting for them to call, it's supposed to be calling me at eight. It's now 8. I haven't received a call yet. So I probably should call to check up and figure out what the heck is going on. Because I need my skin clear. You know what I'm saying? I just do. Like, that's that's just a big thing to me. So I don't know what's going on with my face. But your girl ain't feeling herself no more. So let me call them and then I will get right back to y'all. So quick update. So I called them and they said that give or take 30 minutes. And if I don't receive a call within 30 minutes, then call them back. And I'm just like, are you kidding me right now? But whatever. Uh, so today I'm going to go also get my second treatment. Okay, so this is a long story. So I got my first laser treatment. And I was supposed to go back within the six to eight week mark. And then my appointment was April 6th to go back. And then that's when the whole like shutdown happened. Around that time, like a little before. And I was like, you got to be kidding me. I'm not going to be able to get my freaking appointment. And that was so crappy like i'm not even gonna lie to y'all like i was looking forward to it i was excited and i'm basically starting back over from square one because that was my very first appointment when i went before so basically this is my very first appointment again but this time i'm gonna vlog it obviously i'm not gonna show my goods but i'm gonna vlog it <laughs> uh, yeah that's all guys so y'all got the worst news of my life today apparently they're not doing appointments right now um so now i have to go schedule an appointment well i have they have they're gonna put it in notes so i can talk to my primary care provider so that they can schedule me a freaking appointment with an actual dermatologist off post and i'm just like are you kidding me you had me wait all this long time just so you can tell me that like what sense does that make i'm just so like this 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 uh, laser hair removal treatment is better go good because if not I'm just gonna like my day is already blown and I haven't even been asleep yet. <laughs> I just wanna scream. I didn't forgot my mask in the house. I'm just so stressed out today, just pissed me off so bad. So now I gotta use his mask. So we made it to ideal image that's where i'm going let me show y'all what it looked like if y'all can even see wait a minute i'm slow obviously we made it here and um i'm excited that's gonna hurt it always hurts i'm gonna do a video on that at another time like my experience and everything but i haven't really this is my second time basically i told y'all the process it started over so i haven't really like went through i say like my at my fourth treatment that's when i'll probably like upload a video and let y'all know about it and stuff like that but one thing i can say is it's painful so yeah if you don't like pain don't even don't even i watched a lot of videos and they were like it's not even that bad like all you have to do is it's just like a tattoo it's just like a pinch or like a pluck or something like that and i'm like girl no it's not it is not like a pinch a pluck and it's definitely, it does not feel like a tattoo. Like, that's bearable. This, you got to squeeze some things. My first appointment, I was really hot. Like, it was cold in the room, don't get me wrong. When I first went in, I was freezing. I literally had on a tank top like how I do now. And some, obviously nothing on my bottom. Because you got to take everything off. But I literally only had that on. And then she put like this little cloth over me. And that was pretty much it. And my back was soaking wet. It was pretty bad. So, yeah, I don't know what's up with this camera, but it's like a, it's like some type of blur. It's like a blur on my face somewhere. It's pretty weird. But, yeah, I'm going to get back to y'all when I get inside. My appointment's in, like, 20 minutes, so I guess I'm just going to sit here because we came a little early. I'm in here, y'all, and sadly, he couldn't come with me. I don't even know if y'all can hear me because this is weird. Let me take this off. I'm in here, he couldn't come with me, and I'm about to go get... Change over into the stuff, get naked on her faces, and about to get this thing started. I don't know if I can record 
so I really wanted to, but I can't. Everything's so strict now. I feel like I'm about to go like, I don't even know, like, this is not what like, this is. I'm looking at the table. And yeah, I'm just like, so awkward. This mask making me hot, like I can't even freaking breathe, bro. Like, fogging up the glasses. Just a mess. Y'all. The worst pain of my life. Like, it didn't feel any better the second time. My goodness, she had to go get me some stress balls, y'all, because the girl couldn't do it. <laughs> the girl is obviously weak. <laughs> Let me get my clothes on. I didn't rip the dag on Matt, y'all. Like, <laughs> my back probably sweaty. Yes, my back is so sweaty. I don't know if y'all can see this, but this is my back was, and it's pretty wet right there. So I'm walking back to the car now. And honestly, guys, my hoo-ha is on fire. It's on fire. The hoo-ha is on fire. <laughs> I was going to record, but, like, I couldn't even focus. I was literally holding the stress balls in both hands. Like, the top part is so much worse than the bottom part. It is ridiculous. But, um, yeah, I'm about to go get in the car. I'm gonna ask my baby, can we go to Ross? He's probably gonna be like, no, but let's see. <laughs> can you just let me talk? <laughs> you hear me? Yeah. You just be letting me talk. This is nice. Bro, this is really cute for $6. Like, it's a range. Show them what you get. This, one, this fashionable right here. $6. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. You don't gotta tell me how to shop, right? I shop at Ross Dress for Less. <laughs> 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 Stupid. Ross dressed for less, okay. Mm. Oh, this is spot on. I don't like this. is basic though. I already got a lot of shirts like that. Maybe I already got enough workout shirts. You know? Yeah. I shop in, I shop in the boys section for workout shirts, remember? Yeah. Shop in the boys section for workout shirts. I'm gonna tell y'all, that's why y'all gotta stay slim because y'all can fit the boys section of Ross for y'all workout shirts. I think I'm done, baby. I'm not trying to come in here and purchase the whole store, you know? Okay. We had a crisis right now. Okay. I should go look at the shoes. No, I should not. That's my problem. Okay. Yeah, let's go. All right. Because look at this line. It's like I'm Y'all, so I got my rain jacket. It's in the back seat. It's looking all cute and stuff. It looked like a little, you know, a little fashion statement, whatever. I'm not really fashionable. I used to be, but I got out of it because the military. But anyways, uh, so I wanted to put it on. He was like, don't do that because, you know, the current virus. So I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. So I'm about to go to Marshall's because we originally went in the store for our dog. Not for me. But let me tell y'all, God is good because I only spent $6 in that store. What the hell But this guy right here? What'd you have, babe? Take that mask off your you're gonna be contaminated. <laughs> what you have? What you what you have in your wallet, babe? A seven dollar gift card. Seven dollar gift card. So let me put my seatbelt on because your car annoying. So um yes, I got my item. My two items only six dollars, and I needed those workout pants because they was cute. So and that rain jacket was cute because this one that I got on now is just it's cute, but it's not like cute. You know what I'm saying? So. We're about to head on to Marshall's. So, Marshall's was closed. Yeah. So, we ended up going to the vitamin shop, getting us some more pre workout. It's a pre workout, yes. Pre workout. I don't even know this brand. I'm not even going to advertise it because we're not getting paid. So, nope. And some more BCAA. So. Yeah, we ready to get strong for y'all. I gotta show y'all my guns, but y'all can't see it right now because I'm clothed. And I'll show y'all my guns if Cravante said I can show y'all my guns. I can show my guns. Not yet. Not yet. They not they not ready yet. No. They still prepping. But when they when they bust, they busting. When they bust, they busting. Let me just say that, okay? But y'all, it is 11.38 and we have not been to sleep since yesterday morning so we're gonna go home and go to sleep so 
so that's we have some good news don't mind me i look crusty and i look ugly so don't mind me we have some oh this is some good vibes guys we have some good news i'm finally at a dermatologist's office i'm in the office and they better get me right because do y'all see this do y'all do y'all your girl can't your girl cannot be looking like this i'm sorry it's supposed to be a hot girl summer right okay then okay <laughs> but anyways on like a real note i just really have not been feeling my skin lately you just know when you okay some people really have good skin but if you have good skin when you get that one pimple and you lose your mind just imagine getting like 10. look who's with me guys Oh, my baby is with me. I already know he's driving. You know, that's what he does, you know? <laughs> I'm the family driver. I don't do nothing else but drive. <laughs> and then I shut up when she tells me to shut up. That's right. You know, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. But, um, yeah, so I just got back from my dermatologist appointment. I showed y'all my skin and stuff. And she recommended Accutane. So I think I'm going to vlog that journey because that's going to be a journey. Everybody has so many different like experiences and I feel like that would be something that I could like give you guys if y'all having trouble with y'all skin like me. But most of y'all probably got clear skin. Y'all didn't get this curse. So, um, yeah, this show will be interesting. I can't start it until like 30 days after. So I have to take, I had to take a pregnancy test today. And then I have to take another pregnancy test in 30 days when I go back to actually start it. So, yeah. I'm really disappointed i really wanted to start like asap like i wanted i wanted to start like today but that's just not possible they have to make sure that i'm not pregnant and that i'm not gonna get pregnant i guess i'm, I'm not um and yeah so we're about to go to the market to get us some food for the work week and pretty much that's it go to sleep go to work so the rest of our days old. Watch TV. <laughs> Watching TV. So on that note, I know this vlog has been like really extended out. But it took me a long time to get seen. Like I was really pissed off when they told me that I couldn't get seen that day. Oh by the way, y'all see my eyebrows? Yeah, I used that brow X tent thing again, so turned out good this time. <laughs> 